that's a way to start off a painting. Uh, full sail pale ale brewed right here in Hood River, Oregon. Good stuff, I'll tell you that one. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. Um, as you can see, I've already kind of started off here on this painting. It's just at, right at the beginning stage of the stand thing. Um, and what I want to do is kind of get a warm feeling going on. It's freaking ass cold out right now. We're in the dead, you know, middle of winter here. Uh, it's gray, it's cold, it's drizzly. And frankly, I want to have something warm, you know, and that's just me. So, so what I'm going to do, I've got starting out here by a 36 by 48 canvas, and obviously that means it's big ass and it's going to take a while. And on that note, I better have another damn beer. Mm, 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 mm. But what I want to do, I actually just recently sold a painting that's kind of like, I, I, for lack of a better way of describing this, I, I call it digitized, you know, because of all the colors were kind of like in these blocks. And I'll, 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 show, I'll show you that painting on this production just so you see what the hell that stupid idiot is talking about. Uh, and, and, but first I've got to kind of come in with the warm colors because, like I said, this is the background. This is going to be the damn sky. Uh, it's going to be warm. The sunlight's coming from here. And you need to establish where in the hell your light source is coming from. And so you can understand the shadows and where you're going. It kind of gives you a guidepost as you go. Um, and, and then in time, you'll start seeing these digitized color blocks start forming here. And you know, but you'll have to you'll have to look at the other painting just to see what the hell I'm talking about. Otherwise, you're just like going, Jesus, that guy just doesn't make any sense. But okay. On, on that note, I have another beer. What? Damn, this is good stuff. Hmm. But okay, I'll shut the hell up and I'll start painting here. But the key is, is I just got to get this background, and I've got myself. A sizable brush here, as you can see, uh, is fairly loaded up with paint, and so that's what I'm starting out with. So here we go. Shut up, and here I go paint. Okay. And I'm working on it, working on it. And you just keep working this thing. And on this initial layer, it's not hugely important that I really cover it that much, because just like when you paint your damn house, you know, uh, like the wall, yeah, you know you're not going to get away with one coat, regardless of what the hell the damn advertisements tell you. You're going to have to have about two coats, and that's usually true with a painting, too. You're going to have to have, like, an initial laydown of color, and then you just start building that pigment up. And, and if, if, if you're just uh, impatient and you want one coat, well, that's what it's going to look like. It's going to look like you were impatient with it, so keep that in mind. Okay, back to painting here. And I'm just going to keep working this thing. I really do. I just want this as a really warm painting. And one thing, too, is as I put this background in, just to let you know, and another damn beer on that note, mm, 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 mm. but I put this background in, then I'm going to kind of sketch out what the hell I want to go uh, do with this painting, just so, so, so you know, okay? You know, but I first put this in, and then I'm going to do a quick little sketch here and see what the hell I want to do. And that's up to you if you need a sketch or not. I mean, sometimes I don't do a sketch. I just let the canvas develop. But, but I have already something kind of in mind here. So uh, it's going to have some nice little gentle rolling hills and lots and lots of color. And that's what, that's what I want to do. So, you know, on that note, I'm going to swig a little beer here. Mm. Mm. Damn, that is good stuff. And just uh, tune back in. I'll keep making progress, and hopefully you'll uh, see how it develops. So talk to you later. Get yourself a beer. Get yourself a glass of wine or a cocktail, and enjoy painting. Because look at it this way. When you go to the gallery, if you're already drunk, the artwork looks great. Or if you're looped, you're having fun painting. Talk to you later.